judge a book by its cover. Do not judge a book by its cover. Say it with me. Do not judge a book by its cover, ladies and gentlemen. From young, our teachers have been teaching us: do not judge a book by its cover. <laughs> do not judge a person by its looks. But whenever something happens in class, they always suspect it's my fault. <laughs> Why? Just because I look untidy. You see, these teachers they never practice what they preach. So how do we believe in teachers? <laughs>
通常比較冇嘅。But it's a struggle inside me. It's like the angel sitting on one side and the devil sitting on the other, each persuading me to their own agenda. Agenda. We said you can do it. No, 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 you don't have the courage to. But we said you must do it. No, no, you cannot. But eventually, I found the courage. <laughs> I went over. Hello, Miss. My name is Wei Xian. <laughs> she didn't say a word, she just looked at me and she smiled. Beautiful face, angelic smile, beautiful eyes. It's like never I've seen before such beautiful thing in my life. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, she extended her hand out. Hi, my name is Wei Xian. <laughs> trying to escape away from her place, she, I mean he, <laughs> or it, I think, she started screaming, Hey, we didn't come back! We can be friends! <laughs> so ladies and gentlemen, I guess my teachers was right that we shouldn't judge a book by its cover, we shouldn't judge a person by its look. And they look untidy! But I'm a gentleman inside. I'm a good boy and a good student. Most of all, I'm a postmaster. <laughs> <laughs>